Gamers, welcome back. I'm Robo, a Grandmaster Ranked Player at the game of Risk Global Domination, and today we are Norman the Novice, and I'm taking you guys over to Nanmodal. Um, I've never played on this map. It's a map in the Lost Cities map pack, so I'm super excited to give it a try. It looks very interesting, and it looks like maybe a map that could be very fun with blizzards, because there's a couple lanes that you can move through, and so you can really have some crazy stuff happen. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and this is exactly what I was talking about. So hold on. This is a one-point hold on the entire left side of the board. Oh, dude, no way. Okay, so this is going to be very interesting. We are the blue player, folks. We are the blue player in the final position, so we're going to get a lot of information here. What can we do? You know what we might do, right? I, I, I'm, Dude, oh, and purple doesn't actually cap here. Okay, that's actually huge. So what we could do is we could cap right here, maybe, and slowly work on these bonuses. Now, let me look at these bonuses, because I actually don't know. So we have a plus three down here and a plus three over here. So that's a plus six if I could grab that. Dude, there is no way people do not cap down here. Like, somebody's probably capped right here, right here. Like, who knows? Do you know what I mean? Very interesting. Will the other players have the vision to see what is happening on the board? Um... I'm not seeing, let's see, so we don't see pink and we, we do see red right here, but not seeing any caps over here is a little bit concerning. Let me think about a backup plan here in case things go sideways. Oh no, we don't see anything on the right side and that's actually a huge problem for us. I mean, man, that really is a huge problem for us. You know, what we could also do here is we could also cap on this three and it would secure us this plus seven which is pretty insane, and then we could use that to push through over here. It is very interesting. Um, we would instantly go to war, or there would be instant tensions with red, but we could slowly just work on, on you know, the right side of the board before red. Oh, man, this is really tough. This is so, so tough, but I think I want to chance it. I think I want to go for the left side. We don't see any other caps, which spells huge huge trouble for the left side of the board but i think we're gonna go for it anyway so i hope everyone is doing well today by the way let's go ahead and write down what we can infer uh oh man this is my first game of the day we are still waking up here a little bit but oh baby i've got the biggest coffee cup in the world it returns we're putting in some crazy work today on that coffee um yeah we do see purple uh oh that's pretty bad that is pretty bad so purple's down here in ponwi and i'm actually just gonna guess like tall wall or something Purple, tall wall. Oh no, I bet everyone's on the left side and... Oh no, pink goes for the right side. Okay, huge. This is huge and you're trying to clear out this plus five. Okay, so we have pink on the right side and they will cause problems for red. Now, red, it's in red's best interest to come over here and grab offerings. So I wonder if maybe we could use this three to take cards as red moves through here and makes this area right here patio into a one but okay nice so we have pink we're just going to say non doas okay so pink non doas and then in parentheses right side just because i'm a little unfamiliar with this map oh my goodness gracious if you guys are seeing this video on youtube it might be legendary folks and these are the rules by the way it's basically just the risk meta settings but we're throwing it on this map non modal hold on that was on the right side, correct? Uh, yellow is also on the right side. Hold on, so this might actually be very good. Yellow, right side, I'm just gonna say bottom, bottom right side, because I think that's kind of what we were seeing, right? But yes, folks, feel free to pause the screen right here. Anybody can play in this ranked game. Alliances are off, Fog of War, Blizzard Dawn, and Portals are off. And we're back on that automated AI. Was that in the top right? I miss, yes, that was, that makes sense, because you got a five right there, okie dokie. Um, now, purple has this plus three, which spells trouble for me. Um, if purple does a little wrap around, I'm crying. Red could come through here. Let's think about this. I have, I, I have very, very little to work with on the right side. Um, I think I break pink. Yeah, I break pink because red still doesn't have a bonus. Um, so that's how I get my card. Let's keep this nice and big and strong. I don't think that there's a world where I can get this plus four on this turn and still be healthy. Although nobody really does border me. Maybe I could try. Let me just see. Uh, I get good dice. I'm getting reasonable dice here. I'm gonna leave a two there. I think that's probably okay. That's probably okay. Oh, but purple does have their bonus. That's okay, though. That's okay. This is okay. I mean, they could roll me. It's not a perfect roll, though. Um, it might be enough to where purple sees me as a threat early on, and so they want to. Um, purple's got a tough decision to make here, but we were correct in that. Maybe I should have thought about that a little bit more. 
That's not enough to roll me, though. No, you just want to have a defensive hold here. Yeah, so that's not enough. So that's okay. That is totally okay. And then now I have a bonus for next turn to be able to cause problems. I just need to make sure that I fist bump red. So that was a little bit of a risky play, leaving our cap a little bit weak, but it is, it's totally fine. Um... You know, I respect purple for trying, and if purple had a plus eight, that means that they just have Panwi. They don't have... Well, I guess they could have pan, Pa or Panwi, right? They could have either. Ooh, it's looking like it's just going to be a battle between me and purple. That's what it's looking like here, folks, because pink's right side. We have red right side. We have yellow right side. We have white um, was top right. And then, yeah, I think everybody else is going for the right side. If I can just cause problems here, let me fist bump you. Nah, it's too late. Oh, nice. Yep, that's cool. Let's see if you bring anything back. Or do you leave that A1? I need to be friendly with you, sir. I need to be friendly with you. I am gonna leave that pretty weak until the time is right. Um, I'm also preventing the plus seven. So that kind of sucks for white, because white was coming up here and going to the top right. It sucks for red, sucks for, sucks for white. Trying to think about how this board plays out. If I can just manage the purple player, I think we're totally fine. Um, do I break from Mortuary, or do I go up through here and do like a huge... Because I got a plus four, like I have a lot to work with here. I have a lot to work with. We're predicting white to be up here in the top right, going to war with the others. Ooh, this is nice, because if, if people bought out on the right side, it's actually not too big of a deal for us, right? Because... Ooh, oh no! Oh no! That's about the only way this goes south, is white being over there. Really? White is friendly with me. That makes zero sense, dude. The white player. And actually, let's get into the rules and the players, folks. So, well, we did the rules, but the players in the first position, we have the purple player from the United States, General Q. In the second position, we have the pink player from Germany, uh, Tobinator. In the third position, we have the red player from the UK, General the Brave. In the fourth position, we have the yellow player from Iceland, who is just all stars. And in the fifth position, we have the white player, Crazy Entity, who I guess is a homie. Like, what's up with that, dude? I guess the white player is a homie? Oh, interesting. Um, yeah, I think we, but hold on. If we break here, we were saying tall wall might be the purple player, but um, maybe we can cause tensions. You know what I mean? And then let's just continue being a menace over there. So I just, I just want to cause tensions between purple and white. So purple can put everything right here, but they're gonna have to choose between me or white. So purple, a little bit sandwiched here. Or maybe they put everything on the other side and they try to take a card. Okay, well, that's not going into me. So this is good. I did not attack white. I did not attack purple. And they are now um, neighbors. So what does that mean for my next thing that I need to do here? Maybe I do a little wrap around and come up here and protect here. So I need to take nobility and path and sit some troops on nobility and a la Sipa just to hold my plus four, right? Because that's winning for me. White's getting a plus three. Purple's getting a plus three. So this is totally, totally fine. Oh my goodness gracious. Um, yeah, we will have to see how this one shakes out. Oh, sorry guys, I'm getting a call. Hello? Yeah, yeah, no, SMG? No, yeah, I, I did meet my contract. It was 20, 20 uh, risk bangers on YouTube. That was what you said, right? Okay, so then what, what is the problem? I thought that you... Oh, okay, you want me to tell them to like and subscribe. Okay, yeah, no, I can try to do that. Um, okay, that was SMG Studio. Um, ooh, yikes. They uh, they kind of had an attitude there. Okay, I guess I'm not telling people to like and subscribe enough, but um, hey, man, I really appreciate all the support on the videos. Everybody liking and subscribing, man, it makes a huge difference. Um, hopefully, SMG, if you're out there, if you see this, uh, trying to maintain my contract here. It was 20 risk bangers. I've been putting out some crazy bangers lately. And by the way, if this is your first time watching me, because we've had a lot of new viewers on the channel lately. Hello there, I'm Robo. I'm a Capital Conquest progressive specialist. Um, and I also specialize in putting out absolute bangers onto YouTube. So let's see if we can make it happen here today. Um, I got to say, I like the way that the board is shaking out so far. And uh, this is an interesting map, dude. This is a very, very interesting map, um, especially whenever you throw blizzards on it. Like, dude, look at this. I mean, you got a blizzard down here on the south. You have a blizzard up here in the north. And then all of a sudden, there's just all this friction right here in the center of the board. So now let's say that somebody is able to snowball the right side. I'm going to be literally crying because plus five, plus five, plus four, plus seven. 
versus my you know little plus three plus four plus three so the right side does win with this board we need to try to make this happen quickly and we shall see folks i mean hopefully you got to think like white boy um is seems to be a homie so we will see if um i'm really hoping that they don't recognize the name because people have been recognizing the name and sniping my games and so if somebody does know that norman the novice is something that i've been trying to do lately then maybe they're maybe they're being too much of a homie but i don't think so that wasn't the vibe that i got or anything and i don't recognize any of the names in this lobby so yes now what can i do from here let's just keep this strong enough Mm, I don't want red to come and break over here and red think that there's like nothing else Okay, so then I'm gonna take a card up here and then Let's just do this so if they break me then they open up my cap, so that's okay If they break they open up my cap. I would like to begin working on this I'm just gonna make that let's fist bump That four is for later reasons and then white's back there. And then I'm going to fist bump white. White probably takes a card up there, though. Yeah, I bet white probably hits me. We're getting to the point in the game now, after a couple of these turns, where white and purple are down to their last territories on the left side of the board, I think. Do you take a card, purple? Are you card blocked? No, you do. You hit O and you go bad neighbor. Oh, but wait, did you, you fail that though. So you don't get a card. Oh my God, purple doesn't get a card. Do I emote at that and stir the pot? Oh, I have to. Oh, I have to. I've got to stir the pot. Purple not getting a card. And if you attacked from here, this means that white might be up here. Or is white not, is white even? I have so many questions now. White, so, so this tells me that white, if they have a cap, it's inland wall. So I'm actually going to write that down. White. Inland wall. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, I guess in my notes I saw it white as top right just because on turn one That's what they did But that is very interesting. This makes me think that white potentially what is white? So purple starting with 10 so this means that purple has their five They have their let's see a plus three which mean which makes eight and then did they grab a cap? Maybe why where how are you? You aren't you don't have a territory bonus. There's no way there's 0% chance that purple has a territory bonus. So this tells me that white, um, I, I, I'm imagining white's gonna start with three. If I'm reading this board correctly, we shall see. Um, so I'm gonna actually draw you guys a live reaction of what the white player is probably experiencing right now. So they're probably like, they probably look like this, something like that. So we will wait, let's give this turn, let's let this turn continue and we will see if our drawing is actually correct. Um, or maybe we're wrong, but purple starting with 10 is actually blowing my mind. What are you starting with here, white? What is it? Yeah, so our drawing of the white boy is totally accurate. Interesting. Does white bot? Oh my god, white bots. It's me versus purple down there. I need to go looking. Yeah, I need to go looking. So purple right here. So you've got to be weak. I mean, you just started with 10, so you stabilized, so I missed a key moment because of the fog. Um, I did not read through the fog correctly. Maybe it was SMG that was distracting me. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, we have to slap purple up like crazy. <laughs> what was that? What is this game, dude? What is this game? Oh, now I'm forced to take the baby set. Well, I wasn't expecting that, dude. What do you mean? Oh, and I get some troops on River House. Let's go. Can I just kill white now? Wait, what? What? Dude, wh oh, I have to leave a three there. That actually sucks. Hold on, you guys. This game's actually like shaping up to be pretty legendary. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, but I get the two baby sets. That sucks. Oh, dude, that sucks. We put all the artillery back in the deck to increase our chances. Wait, nobility versus rocks. Oh, it's going to make me... I, I can't look. Hold on. Can I infer? I don't know this map at all. Uh, rocks is right here. Um, sure, I'll just do rocks. Just have a three on my cap, I suppose. Um, if red has a set, I'm crying. Um, okay, red and I have beef now. That's really funny. 
fortify this back onto my cap. So if you open and you want to come try to break me, um, you have to go through a three to get down here. Okay, so let's see if red sets. If red sets, they get the ten. This would be bad. This would be bad. Oh my goodness. But dude, if I hold this for even one turn. If I hold this for even one turn. Okay, yes. Yes. And then red's also guarding, uh, guarding me from anybody coming and doing... Is, are you a bot? Hold on. Let's get a roll call here. Yeah, you're a bot. Whoa. Whoa. I am almost card blocked though. Now red maybe comes looking. Okay, so it's just, let's see, so it's just me, red, yellow. You want to come break me? I do want to fist bump you, but I'm not going to be wishy-washy. I have to take a card right here, so. But red probably understands. They probably understand that the state of the board. I, I'm going to have to come. Now, red probably does have this plus four, right? Unless the pink bot came and attacked a couple more times and I didn't catch that. No, yeah, you're starting with nine, so you do have this plus four, so I'm reading that correctly. So we break we break red's bonus, um, but red will have a set next turn. You pull off your cap. Interesting. I have a set. Now, if I were to set, let's think about this. I would get the 10, and then red would get the 12. So if I am able to actually punish the red player right here, it is worth, this is one of the very rare instances where it might actually be worth, oh yeah, because now, yeah, now I get the 12, red gets the 15, and I break your bonus while I hold all these bonuses. I think this is one of the rare instances where you will see me take a set on three this early um, in an effort to lock down the red player from being able to break me right here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that and then move everything up. And then even with a 15, you cannot do anything, sir. So, yep, because because of the state of the board, we're going to take an early set. Completely crush the red player's hopes and dreams. Oh my goodness gracious, can I just kill red? Does this not connect? Oh? This doesn't connect. Whoa! Yellow says, oops, yeah, you're kind of right. Yeah, you're kind of right. Um, hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Um, this three is doing kind of nothing. Now red sets, and now they have to go through yellow. That's very funny. Wait, that's very funny. If the bot kills red right here, that's equally funny. Um, I'm not going to guard right here because, I mean, the set, sets are going to be for 15. Yellow can't set. Um, what, is, what is yellow starting with here? Yellow starting with five? Oh my goodness gracious. I am a huge problem on the map, folks. I am a giant problem on the map. What are these blizzards, man? A one-point hold right here on Ilisipa? or Or I guess you could say South Steps, but... Wow, wow, wow. Red sets? Now, where do you go? Do you try to come back and smack me? You got to go through a lot of other players. Red sets to just try to stay alive. I did not realize that this didn't connect. Yes, you know, yellow's laughing. So, so red, that was, that was actually turned out to be such a better play than I was even imagining because now red is only causing problems for everyone else. They expend their cards. And now if you want to kill red, I mean, oh my goodness gracious. Yellow starting with seven, so red has two, or, or yellow has two caps. Yellow might have taken uh, pink's cap. That's probably how that goes. And now you're just attacking into red. Maybe you get the kill, actually. No, 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 you don't. Red's way too strong. Depending on how much red went through, though, they might have made themselves weak. Um, you're going to try to break me over here? Wow, this is actually crazy. Yeah, you try to break me there. Okay, so now what I do is now I have a one-point hold from right here in Temple. Okay, you actually made that a little bit easier for me to clear you out without having to split off and leave threes. Wow, so hold on. This jail is a one-point hold. This is actually pretty bananas, dude. This is pretty bananas. The way that these corridors happen. Oh my goodness gracious. See, they, they, they underestimated me, and that was their issue. Norman the Novice. They saw the name, and they were like, look, we'll leave him alone on the left side of the board. Let him cook. Uh, huge mistake. Absolute huge mistake. Um, if yellow has a set on three, it could be for 20, and I'm crying. Let me do it like this.
Yeah, one point hold. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, you're in trouble. Oh wait, red might die to the pink bot right here. Red might die to the pink bot. That would be something. Now, if yellow has a set right here, um, may, they, they are likely still... Oh my god! The bot gets the cards and now they're just gonna attack yellow. They are... Dude, the bot... <laughs> the bot is just causing problems for yellow. Oh my god, dude. This is incredible. This is incredible. Oh, dude, that call that I had with SMG, they must have, like, added some more luck to my account or something like that. Do you know what I mean? Huge W. Do you have a set on three? You have a set on three. That's a good game if you don't. Do we say it, folks? Do we stir the pot? Do we stir the pot? Ooh, do we do Oh, I'm gonna do it. Okay. Watch Yellow actually gets a set on three right here. <laughs> Wait, are we witnessing a bot out? No, we're not. Okay, stars. Our boy stars from Iceland. Our Icelandic player. Oh, dude, this game was such a banger. I didn't, I didn't even get halfway through my coffee, dude. Norman the novice, yes. Watch out for those novices. They might, uh, they might snowball the whole left side of the board. They actually, they might. Um, if you pick up the, no, no, there's no way that you ping up the pink kill, but now I pick up the, the yellow kill. So we're going hunting now, folks. We're going hunting for yellow. Uh, 50 troops is way more than you can handle. We're just going to drop this down to 10. And that will, oh, hello. That's mine. Okay, now yellow probably bots out. Where'd you go, yellow? Oh, that's a problem. Sets it for, ah, but this is fine. I'm just gonna move everything onto this cap. And uh, I need this bot to set actually. This can get very bad. Yes, that makes this so much easier. Yeah, he's crying, yep. <laughs> I was gonna say, because I blundered that and I didn't go through pink, I could have just lost the game. If pink doesn't set, they take a card. They have a shit ton of cards. Yellow has a set. Um, but now there's no way. Yeah, there's no way. So lucky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So lucky. <laughs> I actually am. I mean, dude, this game was crazy. Um, and, uh, you know, I've seen people like comment on the videos. How do I get games like this? You guys don't see how many failed games I have. These are, these are very rare and I really enjoy them. Uh, so yeah, this is a, this is a super lucky game for me. A couple things could have gone wrong. Um, some things are just from me not knowing the map though, right? Like... This is my first time ever playing this map. Um, I have a set. That's horrible for yellow because now I definitely pick up a kill here. Because I'm also just holding so many bonuses and preventing bonuses, right? Because you got to think about it like this. I'm preventing this bonus. I'm preventing this bonus. Um, so what's left? Just Nandoaz, which neither one can have because pink has a 22 right here. Um, if you slam pink, that would just probably... I don't know. That doesn't really do anything for you. I think, I think if I'm yellow, I might actually, I don't know what I'd do if I'm yellow. Because if you slam pink and hope I don't have a set on three, I'm still just going to push through. Um, now, yellow has a cap, right? No, yellow does not have a cap. Um, pink has a cap. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and set here. And I think I can just end it on this turn. I think 94 is just way too crazy. Um, yellow did set. So, oh, this might be the last of pink right here, actually. I think 13's probably fine. Shit. Oh, I get the coin flip. That's so crazy. Wow, that call with SMG really went a long way. In the cap run, ladies and gentlemen. I actually, my brain just shut off right before I did that. I didn't realize I had the cap run. <laughs> I would have totally said a uh, good game well played in Robo Love, but it is what it is, man. I just didn't realize in the moment that uh, that, that was the final cap. Let's look at these players, folks. What an insane game. <laughs> One novice, two beginners, an expert, and we did actually have a master in there. Crazy entity who I guess was just holding out hope that um, things would go different with purple or maybe, I, I don't know, or maybe they were hoping I could help them with purple. That play in the beginning of the game, I think, is the most questionable uh, play of the entire game. If I'm yellow, I take my cap every single day of the week, and the game goes completely different for them. So I don't know what happened there. I may need to watch that back. Maybe I just missed something. But uh, anyways, guys, more Daily Risk bangers are on the way very soon. Thank you guys so much for all the liking and subscribing lately. The growth on the channel has been absolutely insane. If I go back and look at the channel three months ago versus the past couple of weeks, dude, it actually blows my mind. This one was a ton of fun though. More Daily Risk videos on the way very soon. I will see you guys on the next one.